please stay tuned to the end of this video to get an opportunity to enroll in the giveaway that I'll be discussing at the end of the video. In addition, this video is going to be about finding ways to earn money on the road, any city, as soon as you show up and just go right out to work. Oh, I break these chains. I'm bound for the life of the simple things. Good morning, everybody. So last night, I just pulled out the old Walmart as a place to stay for the evening. Now, it's time to head off to work. Well, hopefully head off to work. I'm heading over to the day labor spot this morning. It's about 5.30 a.m. And uh, I'm gonna head over there. They open up at six. See if I can't get out for some work today. I'm hoping to get some work today, tomorrow. Um, and then that should get me about enough gas money to get up to uh, Portland. And I'm going to go ahead and go into Yosemite National Forest if I get both of those days of work so looking forward to that and I really 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 want to climb Mount Half Dome again I haven't done it since I think it was 23 or 25 can't remember for sure right now but that's the last time I tried that <laughs> it was a bit of a chore then uh, and I'm a lot worse shape but it was just such a cool thing. I really would like to have a record of it. So I'll talk to you a little bit later, tell you how it went and everything, and uh, sign out for now. Well, I'm back over here a couple minutes early, but uh, back over here. Doesn't look like they're open yet. I beat opening time, but I'm not the first guy here. So, wait on them to open the doors, and uh, hopefully that'll give me a shot to get out being here early. So I got out this morning, uh, and we only did six hours because there was one of the guys that uh, the crew there really didn't like and it was a job that was ways out of town and we all rode together in one vehicle the guy that drove got some gas money and the guy just finally pissed off the crew leader and he told uh us all that it was you know we that they were ready to let us head out and then told the guy told the the driver and I that uh, they may still want to have us come back uh, if if they need somebody later on this week but the other guy he, he kept us from getting a full day's work so that sucked but anyways I came back I got my check and everything so that's cool it's enough to fill up the gas tank so I need one more full day to fill up the gas tank again to get up to Portland and then I'll probably work a third day for some money for grub and stuff. Now tomorrow I already got my ticket, I have to come and pick a guy up here to take him out and it's a job that's 25 miles out of town so they're going to give me $25 for gas so that'll help out with that and the pay is $11.50 an hour so it's a little bit better pay than $10.50 that I got today so you know that's all well and good and uh, we'll see how she goes tomorrow and I'll check in with y'all but now I'm gonna go to Planet Fitness and get a nice long shower clean myself up and then go see about it, editing up a video for y'all. I almost forgot to talk to you guys about a little bit of a difference when you're working for people ready. And that's that they don't give you a paper check and you don't get automatically deposited. You get paid every day, but 
your funds get loaded onto a card like this. It's called the Global Cash Card. Now, that's, I guess, if you didn't have a, a bank account, I guess it's great, right? Then you don't have to worry about going somewhere to cash and everything. But since I have a bank account, it actually is a little bit of a pain in the butt just because I have to go to an a special ATM to then withdraw. Uh, if I use it at any ATMs other than this one offshoot that tends to be in malls, then I get charged fees, like substantial fees. And so what I do is I, I go in and I pull out everything after it's been loaded you know I don't do it every time and then um I, I use it that way because if you go and you use the card as a credit instead of debit when you're when you're utilizing it you get charged extra fees for using it as a credit which is something I don't like but you know it is what it is that's the way their system works I also wanted to show you guys something again, real quick here it's the people ready app so they have a new app that i just downloaded where you can pick up on jobs pretty easy so right here you see this is a job that's available for tomorrow it looks like all right so this job is for friday these are jobs that are available right now to be able to be picked up on the app and this one's 13 dollars an hour but it's 40 miles away, so I probably wouldn't take that one, and that's probably why it's still sitting here available, is nobody wants to take it. But if it had been in the right direction for where I'm headed, or instead of backwards, I would take this job. It's 13 bucks an hour for Friday, and it looks like it's probably eight, at least eight hours, if not 10 hours, even though it does require some heavy lifting so i think this app's pretty cool and it helps you be able to get out on a job for the next day without even having to be concerned somebody was asking me why planet fitness is i make such a big deal about it and why is that where i go and then also what do their facilities look like and so i thought i'd just start off with talking about why planet fitness now planet fitness is my choice because it's only 20 dollars a month for what they call their black card and that allows you to use any gym anywhere in the country so for me that works out awesome i can end up having the ability to take a shower and even and work out and I can be almost anywhere any town about 50,000 tends to have at least one of these if not more and the bigger towns have half a dozen or a dozen now if you're in a town smaller than 50,000 sometimes it has them and the, but most of the time what you run into is they'll have an anytime fitness there that lets you take care of your stuff that way i am right now i'm trying to only carry the one gym membership especially when it's 20 bucks so i'll show you around a little bit in here so with the black card you're allowed to use the tanning booths if that's what you if you're into that thing also they have uh massage chairs that can be used as as well and then the deals that i really like let's see where they are here is these hydro beds these are awesome i love these hydro beds that's my favorite i actually do that sometimes they have just a plethora of all kinds of uh workout equipment so that's pretty cool is <laughs> I pretty much never have a problem getting access to something that I want. So I like that. Our facilities, uh, they're at least individual showers. That's how most of them look when you're going to the different locations. Uh, sometimes they're a little bit more elaborate than this, but that's generally what you're going to see. 
and then here are their changing stations. I'm gonna go ahead and do a little short review here of the Suwaki car jump starter. I don't have any film of the one time I got to pull it out to try to jump start. I will say it did work. It wasn't uh, over the top great. It did slowly turn it over and uh, go ahead and start the uh, car. Now, what this is, is it's a lithium ion battery pack that has the ability to be utilized as a vehicle jump starter here. And that's what these cables that are part of it are. Right here is the jumper cables. Now I was able to jump start a four cylinder vehicle with a standard battery on it. Uh, I'm concerned that it may not turn over larger engines. I haven't gotten a chance to try it. So I can't answer whether it would be able to or not. Now, what you get with this is this battery pack, like I already showed you, it has a flashlight setting here, which is okay. It's not perfect, but it is better than nothing. And it's stronger than any of those LED flashlights that you're gonna get when you go into say, uh, Harbor Freight tools and stuff. It's, it's all right. Now this here, also does flashing so that it can be used if you get in an accident and you need to have something to be acting as a flare so that's what's going on there with those flashing lights right now now in addition to that what you do have here and what i've used it for the most and it's been very useful for is you have usb chargers here now you can basically set this up to uh, be able to charge at different rates, as you see here, at different voltage rates. Now, I think it's cool having the LED indicator so you know exactly how much battery life you have. These USB ports, like I said, came in real, really came in handy. I was able to charge phones and cameras on it. Uh, I can charge my phone a good six times with no problem. And uh, I can charge a GoPro four times. So with this, I take it in a lot of times when we were having issues with the generator in the RV, I would take it into Starbucks with me, charge it all the way up, and then I had power for the night you know to utilize my phone and things like that so that's what you get you get the battery pack with this you get the charge cable here for charging it you get the jumper cables for jump starting a car there's a number of different attachments in here you can also charge it utilizing 12 volt in your vehicle which is cool if you want to charge it up and utilize it in a van like i would say i get as much use out of that battery itself as i do out of the agm that i have installed in here which is only 50 amp hours but the lithium they put out more power also uh are more efficient you can put a harder draw on them before you drain them all the way that's something that's great about lithium. And then uh, you also get this cool case here. I think this is cool. It's semi hard, so you can stack things on it if you needed to or whatever. It can hold up to getting bounced around and stuff like that. So I think that's pretty cool. I'd like to tell you how to get enrolled into the uh, drawing that I'm going to hold. I'm going to hold a live drawing for this. Here's the one that hasn't been opened. This is one I'm going to be sending out to somebody. 
you can enter the drawing by going to my Facebook fan page, which there's a link to it down here in the description. And uh, click on over there, shoot me a message with your email address. And when you do that, I'll go ahead and get you logged in with a piece of paper that's gonna go into the live drawing that I'm gonna do. And I'm gonna give people, let's say till Monday, this Monday, okay? Uh, so is when I'm gonna hold the drawing. So that's Monday the 1st, I believe, of July. So get on over there to the Facebook page, send me a message with your email address, tell me you would like to be enrolled in the drawing and I'll get that taken care of and we'll see you early, early next week. Get out there, connect with people, live your big story and make sure you do something every single day to it's reduce world suffering. Peace guys. Day without you my friend And I tell you all about it when I see you again we come a long way from where we began Oh, I'll tell you all